good morning friends welcome to ever computers in last video we discussed about introduction to computers first generation of computers second generation of computers third generation of computers now we are going to discuss about fourth generation computers what is the duration of fourth generation computers what are the characteristics what are the advantages what are the disadvantages what are the examples these are all things we are going to discuss in this video first of all what is the duration of fourth generation computers the duration is 1971 to 1989 so coming to characteristics in first generation the vacuum tubes were used in second generation the transistors were used in third generation integrated circuits were used but in fourth generation microprocessors were used the microprocessors are also called vlsi so vlsi stands for very large scale integration so using vlsi the size of computer is very less that means these computers are fit in the palm our hand so in this generation personal computers were introduced these personal computers are also called micro computers so in this generation the computer size is very small they consumed less electricity they produced less heat but they are working very fast but the one and only drawback of this generation is they are not intelligent systems that means they doesn't make any own decisions that is the drawback of these computers so networks also allowed in this generation that means using network to sharing the resources from one computer to another computer that means lan man wan the those are all things introduced in this generation and also some new operating systems were introduced those are ms dos that means microsoft disk operating system so ms means microsoft dos means disk operating system so ms dos ms windows unix apple mac these are all things were introduced if you uh, know the examples of these com type of computers were intel 4004 pentium pc xt etc so if you like vi this video please subscribe iwear computers